Good day and welcome to Google Slides mini tutorial. Today I'm going to show you the few different ways that you can download your presentation so that you can uh, bring it up in PowerPoint or use it offline. So uh, Google Slides do offer a few different options to get your presentation off the Google Drive and down onto your computer. So in order to do it, all you have to do is bring up your presentation, click on File, and download as. And you see here you have multiple options available. You can download it as a Microsoft PowerPoint file. You can download it as an ODP document. ODP is the Open Document Office Suite, and ODP stands for Open Document Presentation. Uh, open Document is basically a free version of Microsoft Office, for lack of better words. It's very good, I uh, highly recommend it, and you can download it for free online. So if you back here to follow download as so you can download it as Microsoft PowerPoint you can download it as a free uh, open document document presentation file you can download it as a PDF document as plain text um, to be honest as plain text I didn't I found it to be very uh, limited it does just take the text only and put it into one big document if they took the text and separated it into multiple pages in that one document, it probably would have been a more useful or put a space or some sort of indication between the document. But what I found is it just jumbled the text all into one large paragraph. So it wasn't it wasn't very useful to be honest with you at all. Uh, then you have the options here for the three types of images. So you can take your current slide and you can download that one slide into a JPEG, into a PNG file, which I would recommend if you're doing an image, or into a scale scalable vector graphic, uh, which is also a good choice, but I prefer PNG myself. It's a good quality image. It's supported for anything you want to do with it. If you want to bring it into a Word document or if you want to post it on your web page as a as a screenshot of your presentation as an example especially if you want to do the title page but I'm just going to show you the first three options uh, what this presentation here looks like once it's downloaded actually what I'm going to do I'm going to exit out of this presentation and bring up one that has a bit more graphics because to be honest with you I only have numbers on this one so I'm going to go exit out I'm going to go back into the your big idea that I told you before that I found very graphically pretty for lack of a better words so once this finishes loading here now I'm going to download it as a PowerPoint presentation as a PDF and uh, as a ODP no, actually uh, I'm going to skip the ODP because I don't have open document installed on this computer however the process will be exactly the same as, as it was for Microsoft PowerPoint so let's go ahead and go right to it so we have our presentation loaded here it has all the nice graphics and everything done up to make it look really professional so we're going to go file download as Microsoft PowerPoint so this uh, presentation now is going to download uh, you can choose save file and save it on your computer put it on a thumb drive and bring it to wherever you need to do your presentation for just for purposes of this tutorial I'm just going to go ahead and say open with Microsoft PowerPoint right now and you'll see what it looks like in PowerPoint once it loads so as you can see once it came up in Microsoft PowerPoint it pretty much looks exactly how it, how it did in online and everything in, on this is still the same as what it was it's still fully Clickable. You can go ahead and change all the aspects of it, but now it's uh, stored in Microsoft PowerPoint on your computer. So now it's offline if you need to go ahead and edit it uh, at work or any other place that you may not have internet access. The other option you can download as well is a PDF file. So this is great for if you want to print your your presentation or if you needed to take it and just show with someone without it being a presentation format. This is wonderful because a PDF is obviously widely accepted and you can open it almost on any computer in the world so I'm just going to go ahead and show you this now as well so you can see how it looks same as before I'm, I have no need of saving it but if you did you can click that and save it right now I'm just going to open it so you can see what it looks like as a PDF it should only take a few seconds here all right so this is the presentation as you can see it still looks wonderful it looks professional and it's easy to go through easy to print easy to store and definitely a great option to be able to download it as a PDF
So that's it. That's your different ways that you can download your presentation uh, from Google Drive onto your computer in the different formats available. As before, if you have any questions, go ahead and make uh, go ahead and comment below, and I'll go ahead and see if I can get to you as quick as possible. And don't forget to subscribe. Have a great day.